your kingdom spouse just had a revelation of who you are and because of that they will do all that you ask hallelujah glory to god this is pastor honoring thank you for clicking on my video thank you for being a part of this family please do subscribe if you haven't done that yet and do not forget that notification bell i have a word for someone and this word is coming to us from Ruth chapter 3 and verse 11 the Bible says, and now my daughter, this is Boaz speaking, says, and now my daughter, don't be afraid. I will do for you all you ask. All the people of my town know that you are a woman of noble character. Hallelujah. And God is saying, when your spouse gets a revelation of who you truly are when they come to know who you truly are then boss who is like the icon like the man the kind of man that every woman is believing god for he says i will do all that you ask me to do because i've had the revelation of who you are everyone already knows that you are a noble woman because you are a virtuous woman i will do all that you ask of me the thing is that sometimes we are just expecting the man to, most often we are just expecting the man to do everything we say. And the man doesn't even have the conviction about us. And sometimes we are dealing with him so badly, disrespecting him and doing all of that. Until the man realizes that, okay, you are a noble woman, you are a virtuous woman. Only then... Can they begin to do some things that the man is in a relationship with you does not give you that entitlement automatically that he should do the things you ask him to do. You're going to have to earn it until he has that revelation. He's going to keep taking you casually and not prioritize you. But when he gets a revelation of who you are, he knows that if he loses you, he has, lose, he has lost a treasure, sorry. He has lost a treasure, so he begins to value you based on that. I hope that this word actually blesses someone. God bless you. Shalom.